Hey guys, real short video here. Uh, as we build this mold, you're going to see uh, these clamps. Um, do not build these yet because you might not want to do it this way. There's uh, better, little, probably less expensive, less time consuming ways to do this. But for those that do want to build the mold jig like I build, um, these are the brackets I use. So they're uh, one by nine strap steel, uh, 3 sixteenths thick, I think. Yep. 316s. Um, call that five and a quarter inch spread and a two inch spread. This distance right here is pretty important. You want to get this, that five and a quarter is pretty important. You'll, you'll see why later. And basically the bottom mold is going to get bolted on tight. Um, we'll call that, I just go four inch. So you're going to need four inch bolts. Uh, this happens to be half inch and I welded this because I you gotta understand I've used these for years for presses So you don't need to weld it. I would just use a pin or a bolt and a nut and there again I this has been stick welded on okay, so when you when you when you build up a bow You got to be pretty fast because there's a ton of glue and it's, it's quite a mess so you want to be quick, but um, When you see these straps, that's what they are so these two are going to be permanently mounted on the bottom of the press. There's going to be one on one side, one pair on the other. And then basically the top comes on, you're going to slam the pin in and clamp. And I'll explain that later, but when you see these straps, at least you have an idea of what that's for and how to make them if you want to go that route. 